to pre-math. In this video tutorial, we are going to find the area of the triangle in this given graph. And here is the formula that we will be using to calculate the area of a triangle. And just keep in your mind that this part is called the determinant of a 3 by 3 matrix. Let's focus at these points A, B, and C. I am going to call point A as is, is coordinates x1, y1, for B, x2, y2, and for C, x3, y3. So then this formula could be written as in terms of these points A, B, and C right here. So I can simply write these numbers down as negative 1, negative 4, 2, 9, 8, negative 4. And these 1, 1 entries, they're going to stay same. Now in our next step, we are going to calculate the, evaluate the value of this determinant, which I have just put down over here. So the very first thing, let me show you an easy way to find the value of this determinant. Just draw the horizontal line like this way. Let's crisscross, let's multiply. Negative one times nine is negative nine. And then we put a minus sign, then multiply the other way around. That's gonna be negative eight. So negative nine plus eight is going to be negative 1. So this negative 1 is going to go in the opposite direction on this side. Let's do the same thing with the next two columns. Let's crisscross again. Negative 1 times 4 is negative 4. Put a minus sign after that one. 9 times 1 is 9. Negative 4 and negative 9 makes negative 13. So negative 13 is going to show up in the opposite side and now for the next value let's look at this one this very first column negative one two let me go ahead and just copy and paste right up here and let's repeat the process again crisscross one times two is two and then i'm going to put a minus sign negative one times one is negative one 2, negative and negative become positive 1 is 3. Let's put down 3 in the middle. So the next step is going to be simply multiply these numbers first and then we're going to add them. So that is going to become 8 times negative 13 is negative 104. and minus 4 times 3 is 12 minus 1 if we add everything that's going to be negative 117 and here is our final step the area of the triangle is going to be 1 over 2 times we figured out the value of this determinant. This is negative 117. Let's simplify that thing that is going to give us negative 58.5. And we know that the area is always positive, so this number is going to become positive. Thus, the area of the triangle turns out to be 58.5 square unit and that is our answer and here is your assignment can you do this problem on your own you can take your time luckily i have already uploaded this video as well thanks for watching and please don't forget to subscribe to my channel for more exciting videos bye